Hi everyone, it's Trip, and today I'm going to have some Thomas Cinnamon Raisin Mini Bagels. One time, I think it was recently, yes I did a, a video about Thomas Cinnamon Raisin Bagels, but they were the big ones. These are the smaller ones, the mini bagels. And I guess I like these just as well. I need to go ahead and get started though because what I did was I, I toasted one of these and I put some extra cinnamon on it. It already has cinnamon and raisins and a few extra raisins too. I'll take a picture of it right there. Okay. And there we are. Maybe I put just a little bit more cinnamon on here. I put some butter on it too. I would normally have put a lot more cinnamon, a lot more cinnamon. I mean a lot more raisins. But it's the sugar thing, trying to control the sugar. So. Don't want to be talking too much because it's going to be, it'll get cold. I love these so much. Oops. so good. I toasted it just a little bit. I don't know if you can see how much I did toast it, but it was just a little bit there. Well, you can't tell because I've got all that cinnamon on there. So you can tell from the outside, it's just a little bit just a little bit browned. Mm. They're so tasty. I don't know which is better, the smell or the taste, or even just the appearance is just so wonderful. The taste just comes at you, it's just so... I can't hardly describe it. You can eat them plain, I mean without, without putting anything on them. But I always love to put extra, extra cinnamon on them with a little bit of butter a few extra raisins and then toasted. I would never put any kind of cream on here like, like a whipped cream or something like that, not even light cream. But one thing that could enhance it would be a nice cup of hot tea. Hmm, some of my famous much-loved Twinings 
jasmine green tea so have you tried these before these Thomas mini bagels or even the regular size bagels cinnamon raisin or whatever I don't remember if I toasted the, the regular sized bagels when I made that video a month or so ago. I can't remember. I should have. I don't think there's anything wrong with cinnamon as opposed to sugar. Sugar, of course, is unhealthy, especially, you know, large quantities of it. But I don't think there's anything wrong with cinnamon. I think it's healthy. And when you toast them, it gives it that sort of a crunchy sort of thing going on there. How many songs can you think of that have the word cinnamon in it? I can think of two. One was from the 70s, I think. Early 70s, uh, just a really dumb pop song. Cinnamon. Let me in. And of course, the main one that people remember, it's really worth something. Cinnamon Girl by Neil Young. I want to be with a cinnamon girl, da 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 da, in the cinnamon world, da 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 da, cinnamon girl. I don't know of any songs with the word bagel in it. There's probably one somewhere. And there's supposed to be 10 in here. Two. Four. Six. Seven, and I just ate one, that's eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But you know what? Is it really supposed to be ten? It says ten. Ten. Blast. Blast it all. Ten. But the truth is, I had two last night and two the night before. So actually, actually there were twelve. Well, 
there were 12. So how very nice. They could have just put 10 in here, but they're really 12. 240 calories in each serving. And the serving is, it says there are five servings. So they're supposed to be 10, then it's actually two in a serving. So two of these is 240 calories total. Okay, the fat's not too bad. Bunch of carbohydrates, uh, two grams of fiber in each one, at 14, 14%, that's 11 grams of sugar in two. It's a bit on the high side for me. And eight grams of protein in each two, each serving. I don't think I'm done with these yet. I'm going to have one more, okay? I got to have just one more. Let me get all these others out of the way so people won't say, is he actually going to eat all those? No, he's not. I just want to have one coal because it's good just, just for a snack. Don't even have to take it apart. I mean, it smells good like this too, but really it's nothing compared to putting the cinnamon on there, a little butter, and popping it into the toaster or the oven. Put some more cinnamon on this. So this is what it looks like, uh, you know, not toasted. Now do please subscribe and like the video and I hope you just watch the videos. Ring the little bell to be notified. Kind of get the thumbnail thing out of the way, okay? Click. There's a more in-depth view. You can see a few of the raisins there. It's uh, not a lot of cinnamon. That's why I'd put more in it. I would, I would call them and ask them to put more cinnamon and don't add any sugar, no added sugar. These are sliced pretty evenly compared to the regular, the big, uh, the big bagels. One side, one side is always a little bit bigger than the other one, but for these they're pretty much the same.
I just should have had some hot tea to go with it. Resist. A little more cinnamon. Thomas mini bagels are delicious any time of day. And that's true, I verified that. As a mini breakfast or a snack, crispy on the outside and soft and chewy in the middle. They, pay, they pair perfectly with your favorite spread or any other combination. That's going to be it. So I hope you like this video and try it out. Let me know how you like it. These little mini bagels. So I hope you have a good week. Peace out.